together every day, having adventures as we play. Up in the hills, down on the beach, always a rainbow within reach. On Animal Island, on Animal Island, yeah. On Animal Island, on Animal Island, come on. Hello. to say hello 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 let's stop to say hello it's a way to say we're glad you're here come on and say hello hello hedgehog hello fox hello pig hello monkey when friends are near we smile and say hello when friends are far we wave and say hello it's a friendly word that shows we care come on and say hello hello mr frog hello hello, hello mr. mr goose hello hello friend Hello. Hello. Hi. Nice to see you. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> It's so good to see you. You're just in time. I was about to check the mail. I'm expecting a letter from Ms. Panda. Let's check the mail together. Are you coming? Look, there's a letter in our mailbox. It's addressed to Mr. Goose, the Treehouse, Animal Island. That means it's for me. Could it be from Ms. Panda? It is from Ms. Panda. I'll open it. There is a letter and some pictures inside. I'll read the letter out loud. Hello, everyone. I'm visiting my friend. Everywhere I go, I see shapes. I've sent you some photos. Ooh, let's look. What shape do you see in the first picture? Hmm. Do you see it? Circle! Well done! What shape do you see in the second picture? Oh, I think I see it. Circle! Fantastic! What shape do you see in the last picture? Hmm. What shape do you see? Circle! Yes. Can you find shapes on Animal Island? Love, Ms. Panda. That's a great idea. We'll make circle our special shape of the day. Let's look for circles on Animal Island. Hi, Ms. Panda. What are you doing? Hi, monkey. I cut out all of these colored shapes, and now I'm sorting them. Can I help? I would love it if you helped. Thank you, monkey. First, find all the purple triangles and put them in a box. Okay. Hmm. There's one. There's another one. This is purple. That's a square. We only want purple triangles. Oh, right. I forgot. There's one. Thank you, monkey. Now, let's gather all of the purple stars. Okay. Here. Here. And here! 
splendid. Should I look for purple squares now, Ms. Panda? That's a good idea. Okay. Here. 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 And here. Great. And what's left? Two red shapes. Okay. Let's put both of them in their own box. Okie dokie. No more shapes. Thank you so much, monkey. What are all of these shapes for? Whatever we want. We can use them to make art projects. Ooh, I could use two triangles to make a bow tie. Look. <laughs> oh, monkey, you look very fancy. Hey, I have an idea! Look! Let's look for another one. Let's look for one more. Do you see it? There it is. We did it! <laughs> Yay! See you! It's story time. Yay! Gather round, everyone. What book are we reading? We're reading this one. It's called, I Don't Want to Go to Sleep. Let's find out what happens. Let's begin. I Don't Want to Go to Sleep. Written by Sarah McGregor. Illustrated by Subi Bosa. Designed by Alexia Grief. Good night, Nandi. I don't want to go to sleep. That's enough now. Good night, Nandi. I don't want to go to sleep. Good night, Nandi. I want more supper. Another book. Just one more song. I don't want to go to sleep. Mama! I need a glass of water. Please? Please? It's time to go to sleep now. Good night, Nandi. I don't want to go to sleep. Mama sighs. What about an adventure? Do you want an adventure? Yes. Do you want to creep through the jungle on the trail of the fearsome hippocrocket turtle duck? Yes, yes, yes! I want to fly across the sky, leap from star to star, fill my pockets with stardust. 
I want a nandy-sized glass submarine to see the creatures at the bottom of the ocean, and a pet giant squid to do water ballet there with me. I want to build myself a pair of butterfly wings and zoom to the roof of the sky where I'll see all the world and everything in it. Look here, Nandi. Here is your very own adventure boat. It's waiting to take you wherever you want to go. See, put your head here. That's right. And I'll just tuck you in. There we go. Now, off you go. Adventure awaits. Good night, Nandi. What are your dreams? The end. Thank you, Mr. Goose. Thank you for reading with me. Kids, it's time for a sing-along with Mr. Frog. Yay! Remember to say hello when you see him. Hello, kids. Hello, Mr. Frog. Let's sing a song called This Old Man. I'll sing the first verse and then you can join in. Are you ready? Yeah! yeah we're ready. We're ready. Let's do it! This old man, he played one. He played knick-knack on my thumb with a knick-knack paddywhack. Give the dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. Oh dear, what number comes after one? Two! You're right. Let's all sing. This old man, he played two. He played knick-knack on my shoe. With a knick-knack, paddy-whack, give the dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. Fantastic! And what number comes after two? Fox? Three! That's right! Here we go! This old man, he played three. He played knick-knack on my knee. With a knick-knack, paddy-whack, give the dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. Great singing, everyone! Hmm, now what number is after three? Four! Yes, here we go! This old man, he played four! He played knick-knack on my door With a knick-knack paddy-whack, give the dog a bone This old man came rolling home. Let's do one more. Now let's see, what number comes after four? Five! Oh, of course! Let's sing! This old man, he played five. He played knick-knack on my high. With, With a knick-knack paddy-whack, give the dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. Thank you for helping me with my numbers today. Oh, Mr. Frog, you know your numbers. Well then, thanks for helping me sing. See you next time, everybody. Goodbye! Goodbye, Mr. Frog! Here's something we already did. Let's do it again. Alligator! Ah! Ah! Alligator! <laughs> Arrow! Arrow begins with A! Arrow! Ant! Ah! Apple Ah Ah Apple Astronaut Ah Ah Astronaut What letter do all these words start with? That's right! The letter A. Letter Safari! Let's find some beginning letter sounds. Hey! There's Pig! Listen! Pig! Oh! <laughs> Pig. 
Oh. Do you hear that? Uh, uh, Pig's name begins with P. Pig. That's me. <laughs> Let's find more beginning letters. Pig. I like your hat. <laughs> Thanks. Listen. Oh. Hat. Hat. Mm. What letter makes the beginning sound in hat? Oh. H. <laughs> That's right. H hat. Huh. Oh. Look, apples. Listen. Ah, uh, ah, uh, apples. Ah, uh, ah, uh, apples. What letter do you hear? A. Absolutely. Oh, I wonder who picked these yummy carrots. Listen. K -k carrots. K -k carrots. What letter do you hear? C. Cool. I picked the carrots, Fox. Do you want some? Thank you, Pig. Let's listen to the beginning letters again. P -p Pig. What's that letter? <laughs> P. Oh. <laughs> Hat. Uh. What's that letter? H. Ah, uh, uh, apples. What's that letter? A. K -k Carrots. What's that letter? C. Let's put these four letters in our learning book. Say each letter with me. P. Hi. H. A. C. Thanks for going on a letter safari with me. See you soon. Let's have a pattern party. Yeah! <laughs> Patterns repeat. Patterns repeat. When I say a pattern, repeat to the beat.
And now it's time to say goodbye. Let's sing our goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Let's stop to say goodbye before we say hello again. We need to say goodbye. Goodbye, friend. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. <laughs> Time to rest. Take a deep breath in. Let it out. Good. Listen. Little Bo Peep has lost her sheep and doesn't know where to find them. Leave them alone and they'll come home, bringing their tails behind them. Little Bo Peep has lost her sheep and doesn't know where to find them. Leave them alone and they'll come home, bringing their tails behind them. Has lost her sheep and doesn't know where to find them. Leave them alone and they'll come home, bringing their tails behind 